Nicole Christofferson with NMC Realty Group. This is another episode of Ask NMC. I was absolutely astonished this week when I was sitting in a mastermind group and I had a couple of veteran, like top producing agents start talking to us about investment opportunities in the Austin area. And I'm gonna speak specific to our area because we are a big college town. I do have a lot of friends in my demographic who have children that have just recently gone to college or are prepping to go to college. And this perspective was such an amazing opportunity for those who have college students, you can invest in a property nearby their college and your student has to own the property for 12 months and reside in the property for 12 months before being able to establish or apply for in-state tuition at the said school they're at. If your child is going to be going to UT in the fall, if you buy a property right now and your student begins school in of 2023, your student can live in that property for the next 12 months until June of 2024, which establishes 12 months of ownership in that property you purchased and 12 months of them residing in that property. And then you'd be able to apply for in-state tuition in the fall of 2024. There are a few gotchas in this. Your student has to be on the deed. Their name has to physically be on the deed and they are not allowed to be a dependent of yours on your income taxes. Those are two caveats that you wanna be considerate of because you don't wanna go and try and make this investment and then have that catch you 12 months later. But there's other scenarios that I want to take into consideration because say your student isn't quite at school yet and you're thinking about making an investment and you're not sure what area throughout the nation you want to invest in because there are a lot of markets that are booming, populations growing, jobs are growing in those areas and people are relocating throughout the United States right now. But you can prepare for where your student's going to live and be going to school for the four years minimum that they're going to be in college and make that investment ahead of time. You can purchase the home a year before while you're going on college tours and put a 10 in that property because right now the rent versus buy scenario in a lot of cases you putting a tenant in there they're paying such high rents right now in a lot of these areas because there's just plain not enough inventory there's not enough homes being built you're going to be able to capitalize on some rental income for that year that your student may not be on campus yet and then once your student's ready to relocate you can then deed your student onto the deed and start your 12 month clock at that point to then be able to establish in-state tuition the following year i read a study recently some families over a span of three years have saved almost $90,000 in tuition by using this investment method for their college student. And again, there's a lot of benefits that come out of it. Your student's able to learn what purchasing a property is like, right? If you involve them in that experience, because once your student starts applying for college, you guys are talking about business and preparations and things that you hadn't done before, right? Real life lessons and choices that they're making. So having them be a part of that home purchase investment is going to teach them about a mortgage, a real estate transaction, what it's like to manage a property or have a tenant in the property what taxes you pay, the insurance you have to keep and the amortization on the mortgage loan so they can be able to be a part of that before they are purchasing their own property and jumping into home ownership. You guys can have a shared responsibility in this experience and this investment. There's a lot of investment that goes into supporting a student through their college career. Housing is a huge one of them. In addition to the tuition, and then you talk about meals, transportation, parking, things that also go along with it. So if you're able, we're able to help you save on this end from an investment standpoint, hopefully you can have them enjoy the other stuff and it's not so difficult for those other costs that go along with a college student's career for those four years, four years minimum really. Awesome investment tip for parents, families, people who are going to be supporting a college student, taking the opportunity to invest nearby a college, have students rent it from you, and then exercise this option for those full 12 months with your student, putting them on the deed, removing them as a dependent on your taxes, and then applying for in-state tuition after those 12 months to save you money on their tuition for the rest of their college career during that time. Hope this helped you. If you have any other questions about the real estate process or this style of investment, reach out. Here's our email here. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel now. I'll be following up with some other information, but thank you for watching another Ask NMC.